Thank you, Tom. There are several new movies waiting for audiences in their living rooms this weekend. News Nation's Dean Richards takes a look at what's new in streaming in this week's movie preview. Prepare the royal jet. We are going back to America. The 1988 version of Eddie Murphy's Coming to America is one of the most classic comedies of all time. Now, all these years later, Coming, the number two America, debuts on Amazon Prime Video with Murphy back as Prince Hakim, who's learned that he had a son when he was in America all those years ago. So he and his royal servant, played by Arsenio Hall again, return to New York to bring him back to their kingdom to take his rightful place in the royal succession. Session. Now, while the new Coming to America doesn't have its knee-slapping fish-out-of-water surprises that the original did, there is a very charming nostalgia to the updated version, with many of the returning cast members back, along with newcomers bringing a whole new level of laughs. Now, much of what makes this movie great is Eddie Murphy's tradition of playing multiple characters buried under tons of makeup and prosthetics, all interacting with themselves. It's a couple of hours of very comforting laughs, and I give it a Dean's List A-. In the sci-fi drama Chaos Walking, Star Wars' Daisy Ridley is an interplanetary traveler who crash lands on a strange planet on which all of the women have been slaughtered, and all of the men have what's called the noise that puts their inner thoughts out there for all to see and hear. A young farmhand, Spider-Man's Tom Holland, discovers the space traveler and tries to hide her, setting off a cat and mouse chase that is very much like the storyline and special effects here. Pretty routine and uncompelling. It's a Dean's List C-. Boogie is the story of a Chinese-American basketball player balancing his skills on the court with parental expectations and romance and trying to score a free ride to a top-notch university. There are too many side stories in this movie and fairly clumsy writing bogging it down. I give it a Dean's List C-. It's in theaters now. You and the dragon are coming with me. Hmm, my sword here says we're not. <laughs> For the family, there's Rhea and the Last Dragon, who comes to the aid of her ancient world to reverse the curse that's been turning people and dragons into stone for 500 years. It's a great story for all, but provides especially strong Southeastern Asian characters, something that can be kind of hard to find in movies. I give it a Dean's List A in theaters and on Disney+. Plus. Also check out the weekend-long Rock and Relief live stream concert series featuring Foo Fighters, Sheryl Crow, Dead Mouse, Carly Simon, and Sammy Hagar, among many, many others, all benefiting Sean Penn's Community Organized Relief Effort Program. Watch it on twitch.tv, YouTube, or rollingstone.com. You can always get my movie reviews and home video pics sent right to your phones every week just by texting the word Dean to 97999. Hope you have a great weekend in Chicago. I'm Dean Richards.